Welcome back to Pizza Tower, the noise update. <laughs> pizza. Pizza, 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 pizza. <laughs> Pizza! Aww, oh, Mrs. Noise was so happy! This is going so impossibly fast, it's ridiculous. Or Noisette. The Noisette or Mrs. Noise? The Noisette. Noisette, okay. Time for our next stage Ancient Cheese! <laughs> Yee! Slap, slap. God, I missed this game. I know, it's always good to come back, isn't it? I had a lot of fun when we did the original series. It was just like, wow, this game is like the perfect game. <laughs> There's, it, it offers a lot. This is, oh, this is not so, well, 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 well. <laughs> I, I, you know how when you accidentally drop something, you try to salvage it, and then it just goes everywhere? It's like, duh, 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 duh. That's, that's what playing the noise is like. Dad, whoops, 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 oh, whoops, oh, 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 hang on, hang on, oh, wrong button, oh, wait, not that way, not that way, not that way, not that way! <laughs> His face kind of mimicked mine there. <laughs> exactly. I don't think we've uh, talked enough about the uh, insane background art that goes into these stages. Because there's a lot to see there. Yeah, I want to uh, give special attention specifically to the fridge level. <laughs> that one is, that one's my favorite. Bam! So the way bombs work are different now, too. Oh, you, do we not pick them up, or...? You just have them, you can't really throw them. Oh, you just... You, you just, just touch. You just kind of, but kind of boop them there, and there you go. I kind of want to do that dance in real life wherever I go. <laughs> ew! ew, ew. <laughs> <laughs> That's where he got it from. I knew I heard it from something aside from that. God, I remember playing that game back in the day. Oh, it was awesome. I remember when Pizza Tower came out in the 80s. Yeah, I, was so, I was so mad when I sold it when I was a kid. I don't know what I was thinking. Well, the only thing I was thinking was, ew, ew, ew. <laughs> ew, ew, ew. <laughs> I think my favorite part about that episode is the fact that when he goes to, you know, getting paid to actually do a cameo, he's just going like, yeah, ew, 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 or something like that. <laughs> I think hitting a bomb would be bad here because now it's, you can't really, like, oh, oh now. that's just uh, damage I have to take now. Cool. Hmm. And that's my combo. Well, almost gone. Okay, so no longer have to throw, but still have to hit target. Yes. Okay. See, I was wondering how they were going to do the don't get hit by a bomb one. Then we get these things, like, well. Well. <laughs> oh. Got it. Absolutely nailed it, friend. Bomb was up here in my mouth, but because I stepped on him, mm -hmm. that. Uh, yeah. It makes sense when you have pizza with it. Well, you know how people can shield themselves from damage just by putting up their arms and they're perfectly fine? Oh, sure. Like, I, I think I've, noise can do that. I, I, I've seen, like, uh, like energy blasts, mm -hmm. uh, knives, axes. Yeah, it's just... just, just that's just it. a big old nope shield. I've, I've seen a punch that has the, the rage and hatred of a thousand demons and suns behind it. Just... Yep, that's it. <laughs> So how strong do those bones have to be, or at least your forearms? Well, you got to be a fighter. And, well, oh, okay, I mean. okay. But Dead or Alive Five told me I'm a fighter. Did you believe them? I mean, I was pretty bad at that game, but that's besides. Dead or Alive Five wants you. Oh yeah, you're you're a fighter. You can really do it. Mm -hmm. Now buy now buy our, our clothes, please. That's more Dead or Alive Six. Dead or Alive 5, that was the grand revitalization of the series. I thought 4 was. No, because oh. that was still when Dead right. or Alive was relevant. Right, that's because uh, Itagaki was still there. Yeah. Then 5 came back, it's like, I'm a fighter, which is honestly a pretty good tagline, because that was like Dead or Alive tag-teaming themselves back into the fighting game arena. Don't say tag-teaming themselves again. And then they upped and ruined it. With 6. As quickly as they came back, they were just deemed irrelevant. Which is sad, because I like Dead or Alive. I'd rather play that with Street Fighter. That's fair. Really, the only reason why I'm playing Street Fighter 6 to begin with is because it's nice to me. I think Dead or Alive might be indifferent to me. By that, I mean every character always says, Oh, that was fun, and you need to think about, you know, uh, they, they're always giving you advice, like, you know, don't get discouraged and pick yourself back up and always think about, you know, always keep your eye on the prize. Holy shit, it's, that is a huge difference. It's it's all, it's so, like, gratifying. And then you, of course, got the announcers that so, Oh, wow, look at player one doing awesome. Look at Lawyer for real. Look at how that, that round went. Wow, it's amazing. It kind of keeps you playing, you know? I will say that's a huge disconnect from, uh, 
earlier Street Fighters, at least in my opinion, because I remember when playing 4, I just felt like garbage when oh. playing that. Oh, I've had my evenings ruined by 5. <laughs> I get it. Five made me feel like I'm a stupid piece of shit because I don't know how to play video games like 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 a normal person. Like like there's something wrong with me. Street Fighter Six, just have fun. That's all I need to worry about. Yeah, what's up, man? You're fine. Just get back in there, champ. You can do it. Because strength means different things to different people. What does it mean to you? To me, to me, it just means making sure I get my daily my daily gains. That's all. Mm -hmm. Get to your logins. Get get the logins. Get the points. Get to get some matches in. Get all the stuff. To me, it's just waking up to a good breakfast pizza. That sounds pretty good to me. I have not- you know, I've never had a breakfast pizza before. They're so good! I need- I guess I gotta find the right one. I'm trying to remember what was on there for sauce, cause, uh... Okay, I might have to bring you back here. When you were in elementary school, did you ever take home, like, a- Not exactly a catalog, but it was something where you could order special foodstuffs that you could get for a cheaper price? Are you kidding? I was behind that. I was- They, they were Zappa snacks when I was- when I was around. Uh, it was- it was a fundraising thing. They had microwavable breakfast pizzas. Sausage, egg, bacon, cheese, all on a pizza. M nuke that thing for five minutes. And I kind of lived off those for a little bit. Yeah, but... Microwavable eggs. It still works. That's a bit of a deal-breaker for me, I'm afraid. I mean, obviously they're not going to be as good as, like, cracking your own egg. But it was still passable. That's... That, I, I can only crack my own egg. That's, that's like, the only thing. Like, I, I don't even get those those uh, cartons that have the, you know, eggs already cracked in them. Oh! Who's the monster that does that? I don't know. Ew! Do you do that? No! You, do you know what you do does... I don't, I don't know. It's, it's, I'll do my own eggs, thanks! Wait, the pre-cracked egg? You mean the ones without the shell? Yeah. They're in, like, plastic? No, I mean, like, they're... No, like, it's, it's, it's a carton. It's, like... Oh, full, it's a carton! Yeah. Oh! Like they're called, they're called egg beaters or whatever. It's just, you know, pre-cracked eggs. Just, you know, pours. You know, there you go. Are you beating your eggs in there? <laughs> no, Mom! <laughs> I hear eggs being beaten in there. Don't you be doing that. I'm tenderizing my meat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Gotta get, gotta get that sausage good after all. That's right, that's right. I, I found in my days I am more of a sausage man than a bacon man. Italian specifically for me. Italian sausage does it for me and so I, much. And I think I know what the difference is. Salt! Salt! Mm -hmm. People over, people overkill bacon with salt. I mean, it's already a, a very salty meat. Mm -hmm. but, but there's people that, like, put it on everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I don't get it. I just want my heart to stop, okay? Let me salt the bacon. <laughs> now, is that just for breakfast consumption, or are we also talking pizza? You know... I don't really prefer bacon on my pizza either. Okay. Because the thing is already greasy as it is. Correct. I and was... then and then you add bacon, and that just adds a, 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 a degree of greasiness that is just unwelcome. See, I used to partake in meat lovers' pizzas. Mm -hmm. One time I asked for it without bacon, and I so much preferred that because I... I didn't have to pick up a piece and it just starts dripping. That's right, yeah, 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 yeah. So I, so it still had the ham, still had the sausage, pepperoni, perfectly fine. Amazing meat lover pizza. It's not a big ham guy either, so. Actually, one thing I do want to try, because I know a few pizza places do it. No, like, chain restaurants, you got to go to a mom and pop shop, mm -hmm. and only if it's available. Uh, chorizo. Chorizo. Oh, that's that. That sounds good. Mm -hmm. Is that actual lava or just really hot sauce? I want to think it's really hot sauce. It's called the blood sauce dungeon for a reason. So I think it's. Just, I mean, you, you, hot red sauce gets hot, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you don't think it like burns like Tabasco does? I don't think it's that. I think no. it's literally just boiling red hot sauce. I've done that before. Just making pasta at home, and then, you know, you hear the boop, 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 when the sauce gets hot. You know that nothing. You ever have pizza like that? Like boiling hot pizza? What, what do you think you burn your mouth on? Ain't the, ain't the cheese, ain't the crust. I just assumed it was the entire pre What the fuck is that face? <laughs> that was awesome. Was that in the original? What face? Yeah, that one right there. I don't remember that. What do you mean? It's, it's, it's the noise update, man. Don't do this to me. 
It's the noise update. Don't gaslight me. There are faces in the wall. I don't remember those for the original playthrough. You, you know, I, I yeah, I really don't know if the levels have changed or not. Either. Oh shit! Yeah, there's another one with no eyes. I haven't I haven't played enough of it to really uh, get it, but uh, like it feels like it has, you know. Small updates here and there. I got a new set of clothes. I got a new clothes. I can get new clothes. Is the noise? Do they carry over as Pepino? Oh, that would be amazing. I better check that. Yeah, I could just see... Uh, Pepino, wh what you wearing today, son? Is just like, uh, pajamas. <laughs> now for the amazing trek back upwards. It turns into a missile. I love that. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, yep, right, yep. Right, good. Wait, nope. Please, right, there please. Your, your, there your we combo, go. Your combo. And then that gets the chef task. Wait, what was the original chef task? It was, uh, do the super jump up that tunnel for two seconds straight. Oh, okay. Yeah, that one was easy. Ah! I know I'm not gonna get a very good score at the end of all this, because they're gonna be like, Oh, you should've got S's on all the stages. Like, well, I'm not doing that. I don't wanna do that. Well, I think we already settled on that, the series to begin with. Well, yeah. But it's, and I'm just gonna have to get yelled at every single stage. What? Oh, because the noise just... Because the noise is a little prick, and then he, like, tries to kill you if you get a D. Wait, what? Yeah, he's got, like, this demonic face that goes, DIE! <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I gotta look that up. I've never seen... I haven't seen anything about this, so this is all, like, brand, brand new to me. I wanted to stay in the dark as much as I could. Oh, I gotta see this. Noise. Rank. Screams. <laughs> I got. I gotta get used to this again. Like, well, I'll get used to it. I got. I gotta learn the whole thing over again. Yep. Because there's there's things that it's just so different now. Brand new playthrough, buddy. Brand new playthrough. Brand new playstyle. Holy shit! You're right. <laughs> that fucking rules. <laughs> ah, <die. laughs> I mean, how bad do you have to do to get a D rank after all? I do like the C rank though. <laughs> I mean, that's how I feel when I get a C rank, too. Just, 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 what the heck? Come on. Not even a B. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. S is pretty fantastic. <laughs> wow! Wow! Okay, this guy's gonna be problems to no degree. Would you please? Would you please? Please do a favor. Oh. And fuck the fuck off! How are you supposed to kill him? All right, I think I'm supposed to do... All right. So... All right. Super jump, and then... Bam. There we go. Stab him with the knife. Yeah, get him. That, that would have been an absolutely uh, crushing way to end a P-Rank. Yeah, one dude just coming up and just stabby stabby. It's just, just one dude rocking my shit. I was going to do a lap too, but not after that performance. Yeah, you got a minute. Uh, the yeah. the amazing in a business suit at Wall Street noise. <laughs> I saw it. He's got the stogie and everything. It's like, yeah, yeah, big business. Yeah, nice. Well. I know we missed a few secrets, but we got all the treasures so far. What was that thing that we, that we unlocked? There we go. Uh, killing four enemies with the... Ooh, Ooh, okay. All right. He's rocking the red PJs. Hello, it's me, the noise. I've got the biggest, stupidest grin on my face. <laughs> that makes me so happy. Anyway, noisette, let me in. Wait, how much money does she need? She needs a hundred or just hundo? Wait, how much? Yeah, just hundo. just a hundo. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's okay. a wet one. That's the wettest kiss ever. Oh. I, thought I felt that one. Ugh. All right, hello, Peppermint. Not much changes from the Peppermint fight, but what does change is the painting. He is painting when he faces you. Peppermint. <laughs> and we don't have Peppino's screen because he's, you know... I, th I think Noise is in a very much different uh, state of mind than uh, mm -hmm. Pepino is. The way he attacks is different, too. I noticed that. Like, he throws bombs, he's got, like, his special moves he's got from the... Uh, from the boss fight and all that. Yeah, well, almost cool. I, uh, 
I mean, it really, it really doesn't matter, but I'll give it one more shot, come on. <laughs> come on, man, I know you can get it. He's gotta get used to how things work now, you see? So, throwing the bombs, does the noise automatically get that in boss fights? And just boss fights? Yeah, it's, it's just boss fights, because okay. he can do it in his own boss fight. I mean, why not on the others when you're playing as him, after all? That makes sense. Yuck! There you go, Pepperman. Blech. Alright, almost there, almost there. And... There you go. Nice! That was a good hit. Sure, you can! Oh! Oh! Dark! <laughs> All right, and, oh. and get out of here. <laughs> the pure malice oh. in his eyes as he takes down Pepper Man. Yeah. Oh. You're fine. You know what? Fuck it. Nail it. It's fine. It's fine. Acceptable. Yep. Yep. Did he get like faster than the original fight with Pepino? Sure as hell feels like it. Yeah, that seems extra <laughs> fast. No, it's 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 just him being being a goober, I guess. Okay. Look at him goobing all over the place. What a goofy goober. Oop, oop, oop. Right. Oh. Couple more hits. Ooh, that would have been so good. I think I got hit again. You did. Yeah. Uh, it's alright, it's alright. Ooh, lovely hit. Yeah, lovely hit. why you gotta be where I'm gonna be? Why you gotta be where I'm gonna be? There we go, alright. This one's gonna be tough now. Final two tough. attacks. Final yeah, oh, that's two fast. attacks! Yeah, oh, that's fast! Never. I, did, I didn't realize where he would be facing. Why do you gotta. What? No! Ah, oh, come on! That is so fast. I think I, did, I think I did a move I didn't intend to. It was that pogo stick move there. It takes longer to break the statue in the second phase. It, yeah. They made the fights harder. D just like in the first game. Oh, right, really? Yeah. Oh, I never, guess I never noticed. And... This is easier now, because you can do that. Look at that big old smile. Piano teeth. You know, I, I, I really feel that smile now. <laughs> yes! <laughs> this is the best cutie ever! Oh. Do better. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna at least try. That feels a bit harsh, though. B for bad. I would just say B for better. Well, I mean, hey, you wanna make a good pizza? You gotta make sure it's perfect. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. That's the first floor taken care of. You can see how things are radically different than they were before. I don't remember where that secret area was. I forgot. I'll get it next time. I think you had the right idea of next to Pepper Man. I thought I, thought I did too. Maybe I was I got the wrong thing. Well, it doesn't matter. Let's head to the next floor then. Ooh, just latches onto the wall with his teeth. Hmm, that'll hurt your toofas. He's got the, just the one, but the several. But he's got sharp ones. I could, maybe he's got like rows of it. First row is like like the one tooth, and then he's got his uh, piano teeth behind that, and then the sharp teeth behind that. Yeah, you open up the noise his mouth, and it's just like sharp teeth. Yeah, exactly. Ah, Multiple well. rows of maw. Well, here we are in floor two. <laughs> yeah, the little leaf frog in floor two. Oh, that's that's kind of adorable. See you next time for floor two on the Pizza Tower Noise Update. <laughs> Was it good for you? You know what? I think it's about to get better. See you next time.